Had a bit chilly last night, Babs? Uh, just a little bit. Chilly. Just a little bit? Not too. It got down in the 40s last night. It was, uh, it was a little cold, but uh, it is crisp and beautiful. Sun's coming up now. Got done with breakfast, had our coffee. I think we're gonna go for a hike, uh, get our hike in, then we'll head home. Uh, but this is a beautiful, beautiful campground. I like that the, I like that the river is just just over there it's close enough so you can hear it but it's not like overpowering kind of like an elkmont where it's just right on top of you sometimes but it's still beautiful Good, like this place? I like this place. I think it's nice and quiet. It just it is. Through. All right, so the power box did great. Did great so far on the camp out. So blew up the bed, we're able to charge everything. Uh, when we get home later today, we're gonna put it to the test at home and uh, continue it and see what all it can hold. Cause so far so good. I'm, I'm very impressed with this thing. All right, so how did it do last night? Uh, after you take it out of the bag, you shake it, and you let it puff up for a little bit, it gets nice and full size, and then it keeps you really warm. Put on hiking boots, go hike. Let's go. See what we can find. All right, we are just gonna cruise up the Smokemont Loop Trail back where I kinda started hiking yesterday, just to finish off the hike, but just see what's up here. Kinda explore a little bit this morning. So Cabin flats, smoke want loot, 1.7. So pretty if you straight Yeah. So on my all trails map, <laughs> which I left in the car, <laughs> we're gonna do the smoke mount loop. So I guess we'll just try it and see where it goes. It's only 1.7, so kinda see how everything goes and this looks like a big fishing spot. Kind of fishing regulation kind of. There's a lot of people putting waders on. Looks like a really good fishing spot. I don't know anything about fishing, but uh, I would kind of just guess by seeing a lot of fishermen and seeing fishing regulation signs, it's a good spot. I love how all the trails are so wide open and they're nice. Yeah, all of these main trails are perfect for, for families to walk, for inexperienced hikers to walk, just to get out and, and, and hike. Basically. And they are very well marked trails too, so it's very hard for you to get lost There's no unless guessing. you're not paying attention. Which it, it can happen. But now once you get off 
back country or you start going deeper into the hills and stuff and you have your maps and you're going on less lesser traversed trails than the bigger popular ones then it does get a little bit harder smaller but they are all maintained for the most part i have been very pleased with this entire park how well the trails have been kept up All right, that was fun. They got, uh, so that trail right there, it's a little nature trail loop. It's like three quarters of a mile. It's a fun one to, it's a pretty good incline and then a decline. Uh, but a lot of fun stuff in Smokemont. Smokemont's a fun one. I really like this. This is right up there with Elkmont. Smokemont and Elkmont are the two faves, I think. Kate's Cove is fun, but again, it's tied to Kate's Cove. I mean, if you're in the off season, it's great. If you got some bikes, even better. Go cruise, cruise Kate's Cove on bikes. Uh, might uh, might make it a little bit more enjoyable. That is it. We're packed, ready to go home. That's it from Smoke Mom. <laughs>